Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the final part of Extreme Rules into our main event. What a collision we are about to witness. Brock Lesnar versus Bron Breaker. These two have pretty much been going at it since the draft. We haven't seen them every week. But every time we've seen them it's been it's been a bit of a brawl. This man just pretty much taking out Bron Breaker at every opportunity that he's had. And Bron was playing a bit of mind games after Brock Lesnar had his own one-on-one -on -one matchup. Bron Breaker came out and just gave him a bit of a round of applause. Saying, well done, I guess. Showing a bit of respect, maybe. Who knows? But Brock Lesnar making his way out here. About to go one-on-one -on -one with his toughest opponent so far in this universe mode. We're still yet... To understand exactly why Brock has been attacking Bron Breaker. Where that all came from. Bron's just a, a new a new a newbie on the scene, really. Done really well in AXT. Made his way up to SmackDown onto the main roster. Was the number one pick, and maybe that just rubbed Brock up the wrong way, I guess. So here we are tonight, Brock Lesnar. In the ring. About to face off against Bron Breaker. Let's get Bron out here. This will be the first time that we'll be seeing Bron Breaker in one-on-one -on -one action. In this universe mode. So Bron Breaker making his way out here. Finally going to be able to put some punishment down on the beast. Maybe if Bron Breaker can get past the beast here maybe he'll be looking towards the universal title picture I guess perhaps we're yet to see that universal title have anyone kind of gunning for it at the moment into the first pay-per-view and on Smackdown it's mainly about people just going at each other's throats really no one's really focused on the champion Roman Reigns and even on Monday Night Raw Roman Reigns wiped out AJ Styles so we don't really have any any competition for him right now, so maybe Bron Breaker can get himself into that picture if he's able to overcome the beast here tonight. So let's get into this matchup, the final match of Extreme Rules, the main event. A beast versus, we could probably say he's a beast as well. Let's get into this one. Brock Lesnar coming right out of the gates, just a huge clothesline. Taking Bron off his feet. Bron, no. Not going to let Brock have an easy go at it. Brock Lesnar, big right hand. Into a big bear hug now. It's a bit early to go for a submission, but maybe he's just looking to wear down Bron Breaker. A huge elbow to the side of the head, and again. And then a big clap to both sides of the head there. And a huge shoulder tackle. Bron Breaker. His first appearance here. Going to be looking to impress. Wants to get into that title picture, I'm sure. I'm sure that was probably the plans for him before Brock Lesnar... Jesus. Before Brock Lesnar decided otherwise. Once again, there's no disqualification. It is extreme rules, of course. That's why Brock Lesnar going for those still steps. But Braun Breaker not letting him have it. Now, Braun Breaker was looking for that belly-to-belly, -belly, but Brock Lesnar knows that all too well. Brock Lesnar coming back into the ring. A big boot to the face of Bron Breaker. Bron Breaker needs to be careful here that he doesn't let Brock Lesnar just overpower him. I'm not sure there's many men that can do that to Bron Breaker, but Brock Lesnar is definitely one of them, if anyone can. Into the cover again. No, big kick out. Bron Breaker staying in this matchup. And a big spear out of absolutely nowhere. From Bron Breaker into the cover. Could this be it? No. Just a two count. Bron Breaker pulling that spear out from absolutely nowhere. And a big spine buster as well to follow. Really targeting the ribs of Brock Lesnar. Trying to take the wind out of him, I guess. I'm sure Brock is all too familiar with those spears. Especially all these rivalries with Roman Reigns throughout the years. Of course, Brock Lesnar lost that WWE Championship to 
Roman Reigns at WrestleMania. Which is why the Tribal Chief is the undisputed champion right now. But right now, Brock Lesnar, a big strike to the midsection of Bron Breaker. Perhaps going for those still steps once again. Going for the other still steps this time. Bron Breaker, though, gonna perhaps try and challenge Brock with that kendo stick. Brock deciding against using those still steps. Big strike to the midsection instead. Oh, and a big slam on the outside. Once again, targeting those ribs. Went for that belly to belly suplex again, Bron Breaker. Couldn't quite get it. Brock Lesnar with a big tackle. Now Brock with some big strikes and slamming Bron Breaker down into the floor just there. A big headbutt. Bron Breaker trying to just tame the beast here at Extreme Rules. Oh, I'm driving him face first into that steel ring post. His ears must be ringing right now. Bron Breaker laying waste to the beast with that kendo stick. Oh, and a huge clothesline taking off the head of Bron Breaker almost. Back and forth we go between these two. We knew this would be a hard-hitting contest. A close contest as well. Oh, and some big knee strikes. Here we go from Brock Lesnar. It's vintage of Brock into the cover now. Now, Bron Breaker has plenty more fight left in him. Brock Lesnar looked a little bit surprised there. Brock going for that kendo stick. He's asking Brock, Bron Breaker to meet him outside, but I don't think he realised Bron was already on his way. Brock's having none of those suplexes. He, he's, he's the founder of Suplex City. So I don't think he's going to let anyone take his real estate. And huge strikes from Bron Breaker on the outside. Just gaining moment momentum now. Into the bear hug. It is on the outside though. So even if Brock does tap. It won't lead to a victory. But Brock able to get those big elbows to the side of the head. And now clapping the, the, both ears. Oh and a huge clothesline again. One breaker suffering a little bit now, and now a bear hug of his own. Brock Lesnar once again. I would not be like to be on the receiving end of either of these guys having a bear hug. Can Braun Breaker break out of it? Yes, he can. Of course, he can. It's in the name. Now Braun Breaker with a clothesline, and he's feeling it here. Brock Lesnar straight back to his feet though. Braun Breaker. Looking to try and capitalise, but Brock Lesnar with him up on his shoulders now. No, Bron Breaker staying on top of things. Might want to get Brock back into the ring. That's where this match is going to be won and lost. I think he heard me. He's taking it back into the ring now. Bron Breaker just taking a moment to himself. Oh, and he's been just tackled down to the ground. A vicious... Vicious tackle from Brock Lesnar. Into the cover once again by the Beast. I'd be surprised if this is enough, but... Oh, a big kick out from Brock. Sorry, from Bron. Easy to muddle their names up. I seem to really struggle with names, don't I? Oh my. Brock Lesnar. Into the F5 out of absolutely nowhere. Into the cover. Could this be it? No! No! Bron Breaker kicks out. Brock Lesnar cannot believe it. A huge kick out from Bron Breaker. Now the crowd trying to get behind Lesnar here. I'm surprised at that. Bron Breaker trying to get them on his side though. Brock with those still steps. He decided against it. Now Bron Breaker with that ladder. And driving that into the, the skull of the beast. Decided one strike was enough. Bron Breaker driven into the apron just there. And driven face first into the announce table. And Bron Breaker has been busted wide open. A huge gash across the forehead. Sending Brock back into the ring. 
But Breaker with a huge clothesline this time. Looking to gain some momentum into the back body drop. And the spine buster to follow. Vintage Bomb Breaker into the cover now. Could this be it? Two. No, the Beast able to kick out. Bomb Breaker almost had like a second win there after being busted open. Now Bomb Breaker always into the submission here. Could he make the Beast tap perhaps? Bomb Breaker is really feeling it. I don't think Brock can quite reach those ropes. He's going to have to break the hold, I feel. And he does. I'd be shocked if Brock Lesnar was to tap out. I don't think he's ever tapped out. Bron Breaker came really close, though, just then. And a huge German suplex now from Brock Lesnar. Welcome to Suplex City. Once again, going for the German suplex now. Into the triples. Literally... Entering Suplex City. Now then Brock Lesnar bringing him up onto his feet. Into the F5 again. No. Bron Breaker able to fight out of it. Maybe he's going to try and finish the matchup himself here. Oh my god. Look at the power and the strength. Bron Breaker. Military pass into the power slam. Could this be it? Into the cover. No, the Beast is able to kick out. Oh my word. His last two matches at this pay-per-view have been absolutely unreal. Not that the first few were disappointing, they weren't. It's just these ones have been, you think it's over, then all of a sudden things are still going. Brock Lesnar decided to go after those still steps, yet to actually use them in this match on Breaker. Not able to capitalise here. Another suplex from Brock. Just tossing Bron Breaker across the ring. And again, into another suplex. Just hooked the leg that time. Now a bit of ground and pound from Brock. Looking to maybe open up that wound a bit more. Keeping the pressure on here is Brock. Into the cover. He, he may feel like this is it. No, Bron Breaker getting that shoulder shoulder up. Bron Breaker showing that he can really hang with the best of them here. Brock Lesnar just targeting that arm, maybe trying to set up the Kimura. Brock to the outside, looking for another weapon here. Back to that sledgehammer we go. Brock decides against using it, and here we go into... The Kimura, it seems. Doesn't look like he's got it quite locked in all the way. Not able to wrap those legs around the waist just yet. Bron Breaker could be fading here, though. No, he's able to fight out of it. Plenty of fight left in Bron Breaker. Now Bron Breaker going after that sledgehammer himself and targeting the knee and the midsection of the beast. Telling the Beast to bring it. The beast able to avoid that strike and that one too. Now, Brock Lesnar may have been going for that Kimura once more, but Bron Breaker was able to avoid it. Now, Bron Breaker going for that submission once more. Can he make the Beast tap? Of course, there's no rope break. Oh my goodness, and Brock Lesnar has tapped out to Bron Breaker. Well... That is a huge, huge victory. But it looks like Bron Breaker is really suffering here. Oh no, the X has been thrown up. Oh no. Bron Breaker. I feel like he, he may be suffering an injury right now. He's been busted wide open. The blood pouring from his face. I'm not sure if it's a body injury, probably a head injury. Probably got a bit of concussion as well, but... What a victory that is. He managed to make the Beast tap out. I don't think anyone's ever done that. But anyway, that's the end of Extreme Rules pay-per-view. We'll be back for Monday Night Raw in the next episode. So if you did enjoy this episode, make sure you dr drop a like down below. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell as well. And I'll see you on Monday Night Raw. So peace out, guys.